This is a Siku 1353 Bugatti Veyron Grand Sport Car diecast model. The Bugatti Veyron EB16.4 is a mid-engine sports car, designed and developed in France by the Volkswagen Group, and Bugatti and manufactured in Molchium, France, by French automobile manufacturer Bugatti. It was named after the racing driver Pierre Veyron. The original version has a top speed of 407 km per hour, 253 miles per hour. It was named Car of the Decade and Best Car Award, 2000-2009, by the BBC television program Top Gear. The standard Bugatti Veyron also won Top Gear's Best Car Driven All Year Award in 2005. The Super Sport version of the Veyron is one of the fastest street-legal production cars in the world. With a top speed of 431.072 km per hour, 267.856 miles per hour. The Veyron Grand Sport Vitesse was the fastest roadster in the world, reaching an average top speed of 408.84 km per hour, 254.04 miles per hour, in a test on April 6, 2013. The Veyron's chief designer was Hartmut Warkus, and the exterior was designed by Josef Cabin of Volkswagen, with much of the engineering work being conducted under the guidance of Chief Technical Officer Wolfgang Schreiber. The Veyron includes a sound system designed and built by Burmester Audiosystem. Several special variants have been produced. In December 2010, Bugatti began offering prospective buyers the ability to customize exterior and interior colors by using the Veyron 16.4 configurator application on the Mark's official website. The Bugatti Veyron was discontinued in late 2014, but special edition models continued to be produced until 2015. In May 1998, Volkswagen AG acquired the rights to use the Bugatti logo and the trade name Bugatti Automobiles SAS to succeed the EB110 model produced under the previous ownership. The automaker quickly released a series of concept cars, whose technological advancements would culminate in the form of the Veyron 16.4. Between October 1998 and September 1999, Bugatti introduced a series of Giugiaro-designed concept vehicles, each with permanent four-wheel drive and powered by the Volkswagen-designed W18 engine. The first car, the EB118, was a two-door luxury coupe presented at the 1998 Paris Motor Show. The next car, the EB218, was a four-door saloon presented at the 1999 Geneva Motor Show. The third and final car, the 18-3 Chiron, was a mid-engine sports car presented at the 1999 International Motor Show in Frankfurt. In October 1999, Bugatti unveiled a fourth concept car at the Tokyo Motor Show. The EB18 Fourths Veyron was a mid-engine sports car styled in-house, under the direction of Hartmut Warkus. In 2000, a modified version, the EB16-4 Veyron, was displayed at motor shows in Detroit, Geneva, and Paris. Rather than the three-bank W18 engine of the four previous concept cars, the EB16-4 featured the four-bank W16 engine architecture installed in every production example of the Veyron. The decision to start production of the car was made by the Volkswagen Group in 2001. The first roadworthy prototype was completed in August 2003. It is identical to the later series variant, except for a few details. In the transition from development to series production, considerable technical problems had to be addressed, repeatedly delaying production until September 2005. The Veyron EB16.4 is named in honor of Pierre Veyron, a Bugatti development engineer, test driver and company race driver who, with co-driver Jean-Pierre Wimille, won the 1939 24 Hours of Le Mans while driving a Bugatti. The EB refers to Bugatti founder Ettore Bugatti, and the 16.4 refers to the engine's 16 cylinders and quad turbochargers. The Veyron features an 8.0 liter, quad turbocharged, W16 cylinder engine, equivalent to two narrow angle V8 engines bolted together. Each cylinder has four valves for a total of 64, but the configuration of each bank allows two overhead camshafts to drive two banks of cylinders, so only four camshafts are needed. 
The engine is fed by four turbochargers and displaces 7,993 cubic centimeters, 487.8 CUN, with a square 86 by 86 millimeters, 3.39 by 3.39 in, bore and stroke. Bugatti Veyron 16.4. Bugatti Veyron interior. The transmission is a dual-clutch direct-shift computer-controlled automatic transmission having seven gear ratios, with magnesium paddles behind the steering wheel and a shift time of less than 150 milliseconds. Built by Ricardo of England rather than BorgWarner, who designed the six-speed DSG used in the mainstream Volkswagen Group Marquez. The Veyron can be driven in either semi-automatic or fully automatic mode. A replacement transmission for the Veyron costs just over 120,000 US dollars. It also has permanent all-wheel drive using the Haldex traction system. It uses special Michelin PAX run-flat tires, designed specifically to accommodate the Veyron's top speed, and cost 25,000 US dollars per set. The tires can be mounted on the wheels only in France, a service which costs 70,000 US dollars. Curb weight is 1,888 kilograms for 1,162 pounds. This gives the car a power to weight ratio, according to Volkswagen Group's figures, of 530 PS, 390 kilowatts, 523 HP per ton. The car's wheelbase is 2,710 millimeters, 106.7 in. Overall length is 4,462 millimeters. 175.7 in, which gives 1,752.6 millimeters, 69.0 in, of overhang. The width is 1,998 millimeters, 78.7 in, and height 1,204 millimeters, 47.4 in. The Bugatti Veyron has a total of 10 radiators, three heat exchangers for the air to liquid intercoolers, three engine radiators. One for the air conditioning system. One transmission oil radiator. One differential oil radiator. One engine oil radiator. According to Volkswagen Group and certified by TV Sud Deutschland, the W16 engine utilized by the Veyron has a power output of 736 kilowatts, 987 HP, 1001 PS and generates 1,250 Nm, 922 lbfft of torque. German inspection officials recorded an average top speed of the original version at 408.47 km per hour, 253.81 miles per hour, during test sessions on Volkswagen Group's private Aerolation test track on April 19, 2005. This top speed was almost matched by James May on Top Gear in November 2006. At the Aerolation test track, at 407.5 km per hour, 253.2 miles per hour. May noted that at top speed the engine consumes 45,000 L, 9,900 imp gal, of air per minute, as much as a human breathes in four days. Back in the Top Gear studio, Co-presenter Jeremy Clarkson commented that most sports cars felt like they were shaking apart at their top speed, and asked May if that was the case with the Veyron at 407 km per hour, 253 miles per hour. May responded that the Veyron was very controlled, and only wobbled slightly when the air brake deployed. The car's normal top speed is listed at 343 km per hour, 213 miles per hour. When the car reaches 220 km per hour, 137 miles per hour, hydraulics lower the car until it has a ground clearance of about 9 cm, 3.5 in. At the same time, the wing and spoiler deploy. In this handling mode, the wing provides 3,425 newtons, 770 lbf, of downforce, holding the car to the road. Top speed mode must be entered while the vehicle is at rest. Its driver must toggle a special top speed key to the left of their seat, which triggers a checklist to establish whether the car and its driver are ready to attempt to reach 407 km per hour, 253 miles per hour. If so, the rear spoiler retracts, the front air diffusers shut, and normal 12.5 cm, 4.9 in, ground clearance drops to 6.5 cm, 
2.6 in. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe our channel and like our Facebook page.